Hey, Bones Rodriguez for Entreperformers.com. Uh, I was in the train with my wife just now, coming back from a little shopping and stuff. We're gonna stop by Whole Foods and get some food, Whole Foods. Um, and a woman came on the train begging for something and gave me an idea I wanna ask you a question about. Come right back. Okay, so as I was mentioning, I was in New York City, it's a beautiful day out, excuse the squinting, you know, uh, some of you know, it's always bright out here for my eyes, but uh, a woman came on the train, she said, sorry to bother you ladies and gentlemen, and I'm blah 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 blah, I'm out here on the street, you're my only hope, so I'm begging, instead of selling my body, hurting somebody, or stealing something, and my immediate thought was, wow, apparently there are only four choices, that woman thinks that there are only four choices, begging, selling your body, hurting somebody, and stealing. And I thought to myself, well, Bones, in what area of your life do you think you have limited choices in? And I asked myself that question, and I came up with a few answers. But uh, my question is for you. You probably, right now, are under the impression there are only a couple options. I know a lot of actors think that waiting tables and bartending are the only options, or babysitting, but there are many, many more options. So A, how can you find some for yourself, and then, how can you help other people have them? Because what you do for other people comes back to you. Be the source for what you want in life. That's today's lesson. Amazing, right? Cool. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.